Oh. Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome, welcome back to the channel. Um, we are trying to push off, but it's not really working because we got a bunch of gorditos. <laughs> Parisito. Yeah, we're trying to push, push off. Marano. It's amarado. It's amarado. Si, si, si. Yeah, yeah. Hala. 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 Estamos amarado. When you salo, salo. Yeah, you're going to salo. All right, finally, we have pushed off. Now, guys, we're like four people on this little canoe here uh, on the Amazon. And and we are heading into the next village called Santa Maria, which right now, because due to the low low level of the water, you are very 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 it's very difficult to get into Santa Maria del Real because. The water's so low um, that big boats can't, you know, if you have an outboard engine right now, it's very tough to get through the Rio Sinchicui, which is where Santa Maria del Real lies on, because, of course, being it's, it's a small tributary, when the small tributaries in the dry season, they really drop to like, you know, nothing but nothing more than like a, like a, a six foot creek. Um, so yeah, here we are. We got uh, Capitan Elvis. It's my best friend, and he's my best friend here in uh, in Peru. Uh, so he's leading the charge, and we're hitting some we're hitting some waves right now. Getting a little choppy. Of course, Miguelito is in the back command, and Iraquio behind the wheel. Kills the captain, Capitan Hakob, and we're off. Uh, we've got a we're we're strapped to a we're we're strapped to like a small 5.5 horsepower engine, um, which does the trick. But you know what it is? It's the Peke Peke engines have those long throttles. It's like a seven foot, eight foot uh, sort of a throttle that you can then lift off, out, and in, and left and right, whichever way you want to go. And that's the only way you can get around these shallow rivers because um, because otherwise, you know, you're, you're stuck. There's de definitely, definitely with an outboard, it, it's, it's a no-go, you know. So if you want to go great, get some great fishing and things like that on the small shallow rivers where there's plenty of fish, then, then that's the only way you'll get through there, you know. So the, Necessarily a bigger boat doesn't mean um, for these conditions, you know, at least it, it's not the best thing. Uh, it's not the best thing. Now, there's the mouth of the Sinchikui River right there, but you can't even tell that there is a, an entrance.
definitely not get through there, guys. Yeah. Bien seco, huh? Menos de, menos de un metro. Pero esta, esta temporada bien seca. Bien seca. So yeah, guys, we can't even enter through the Rio Sinchikui because for some reason this year, uh, because of certain, you know, like sometimes it takes like 12, uh, 12, um, 12 year cycles where it's really, 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 really dry. And you know, if the river dries out, oh well. So they've made like a, like a makeshift port here so you can enter and exit the village. And we're getting just there. frente pockets aquí y porque es no, no confortable pero no, no tengo pocket para nada aquí solo la, la, atrás pero mi culo es grande no hay espacio no parte mi billetera bien yeah, so here we go guys no tiene plata no porque tiene billetera tarjetas hombre de plástico si sí, si sí. Plástico fantástico. Eso, here we are. Buena, buena. No es posible no ensuciar. Ok, ahora we get to Santa María, así de hecho. Ok. ¿Por qué? No tiene ensuciar zapatos. ¿Qué tu pie? 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 ¿Qué tu Castron chicks. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, so this is life on the river. Um, right. So, right here, we're going to do hasta la chow chow. Bye for now, over and out, from the Amazon jungle of Peru. Of Peru.